And Jesus came in a boat back to the other side, and he was met by a huge crowd. He was by the sea. And a leader of the synagogue, Jairus by name, seeing him, comes to him, falls before him, and pleads with him urgently, saying, My little daughter, she's at the point of death. Come, lay hands on her so that she might be restored and live. And Jesus, Jesus went with him, and the whole crowd was following him, pressing on him. Now there was a woman who had suffered from a flow of blood for 12 years, having suffered many things under the hands of many healers, <laughs> having indeed spent everything she had and not having gotten better, but really having gotten worse. Hearing about Jesus coming behind him in the crowd, she, oh, she touched his cloak. Because she'd been saying to herself, if I just touch his cloak, I'll be restored. And oh, the source of the bleeding dried up within her, and she knew in her body that she had been healed. Jesus knew within himself. Oh, power had gone out of him, so he turned around in the crowd and said, who touched my clothes? His disciples said, you see the crowd pressing you on all sides and you ask who touched you? Jesus kept looking to see who had done it. And the woman, knowing what had happened to her, trembling and afraid, fell down before him and told him the whole truth. Jesus said to her, daughter, Your courageous trust has saved you. Go off and be free of your affliction. Now while he speaks, some people come from the house of the leader of the synagogue, and they say to him, Your daughter, she's, she's died. Why trouble, trouble this teacher any longer? But Jesus, overhearing it, says to him, Don't be afraid. Trust courageously. And he wouldn't let anyone go along with him except for Peter, and James, and John. And they come to the house of the synagogue leader. He sees a great commotion, lots of weeping and wailing. And entering to the house, he says, while this commotion, this weeping and wailing, the child's not dead, she's sleeping. And they taunted him. And driving them out, Jesus took with him the father of the little girl and her mother and, he, and those with him. And he comes to the place where she was. And taking her hand, he says to her, Talitha kum which means, little girl, I say to you, rise. And she rose, started walking around. I mean, she was 12 years old. And they, they were stunned with great astonishment. Oh, and Jesus ordered them strictly to tell no one. And to give the girl something 